Hi there. I'm going ahead and get started working on my freezer. Uh, kind of quickly going through to see what needs to be uh, eliminated, um, maybe moved out, maybe we rotated, things like that. So we have a small freezer, so it's not going to be like a lot. <laughs> um, normally I organize it where one side is uh, protein, the other side is vegetables, um, maybe some broth in there that's been made up, obviously some other types of uh, leftover stuff, just that, just to see what's in there. So I know, for example, I have a butter chicken in there um, and I know I have some uh, squares for broths um, and things like that. So I kind of just want to go in there and maybe take a look at what the date is on the, on the plastic um, and just see if I can move stuff around a little bit. Um, and then of course, while I'm there, I may as well wipe it all down, right? So that's the whole touch once scenario. So I'm in here, I'm gonna do a bit of, spring cleaning I may as well grab some warm water some baking soda quickly wipe down as I move things out and move things around and then um, and then it's also a good thing to do that when you're actually like restocking your freezer or your fridge right so if you're gonna restock um, and you know it's close to being empty or half empty or you're buying more groceries or whatever it might be so we buy our protein kind of like once a month so therefore um, at that point in time, definitely spend a bit of time going through some stuff and getting rid of things that maybe you don't need anymore um, or you're not using or you just know you're not going to touch it. So there's no point in wasting the space that way, right? Just toss it out, move on um, and just go from there. Not every time uh, things go the right way you want. So sometimes you got to waste a little bit of food, but that's just what happens. There's no point in being upset about it. Just let go of the guilt um, and let go of the hoarding mentality too if you might have a little bit of that let that go you need room for the more stuff you're going to be doing and then that's kind of the whole scenario if you can organize it so that you can see what you're doing um you're more likely to know like quick look at it aha uh -huh, this is the proteins i have maybe even you don't even have to go it's in your mind you know what's in there the other side could be frozen veggies and fruits things like that um, and leftovers maybe and then if you have a tray on top that could be just what your choice is so one side is our ice cubes and some butter and then the other side is <clears throat> um like my leftover cubes and things like that that i make and use up so there you go a little bit about freezer um and my etiquette and how i kind of try to keep things uh, moving and keep things uh, clean and organized um, I'd love to hear yours what your fridge looks like go ahead and post below what it looks like now maybe it looks like after before and after photos we love those um, yeah have a great day thanks